You don't need to know that. All you need to know is that a felony has been committed by someone on your squad, and I'm going to find out who did it. Now, have you ever taken confidential information about an ongoing investigation out of this precinct? <laughs> no. I would never do something that stupid. I did something really stupid. I need your help. You know, I'm kind of a sexy bad boy who rides motorcycles into work and is always breaking the rules in the name of justice. I don't like where this is going. Well, I also maybe sometimes bring home case files to work on them after hours, and I might not be that great about returning them. Oh, God. Are you aroused because of what a bad boy I am? No. No. You could be suspended for that. He could think you're the mole. Sure, not so loud. Yes, Amy, I do drink from the bowl. Definitely pulled that off. Look, I need to get those files. Can you please give me a ride? Fine get my stuff, but this better not bite me in the ass. Better not bite me in the ass, name your sex tape, but seriously, thank you so much for your help. Peralta, how'd it go with Miller? Fantastic, he loved me. I would give you more details, but someone just came in to try and find her Dalmatian coat. Hello, Raymond. Madeline, I wondered why all the birds had suddenly stopped singing. What brings you here? I heard you were under investigation by Internal Affairs. Didn't want to miss that. So much time with your ear to the pavement, it's a pity a truck hasn't run over your head. Very visual. When, oh, when will you quit police work and pursue your dream of poetry? I'm looking for Detective Scully. You must be from IAB. I'm Deputy Chief Wunsch. Nice to meet you. If you have a minute, I'd love a detailed report of this investigation. IAB exists outside of department hierarchy. I don't answer to you. Detective Scully, you're up. Oh, uh, OK. Um, no. You know, we'll do this over the phone. Oh, Raymond, an internal affairs investigation? A drug task force that hasn't found any drugs? This precinct's a disaster. Maybe that's why the birds stopped singing. Out of respect for the death of your career. Goodbye, Raymond. Detective Diaz, can you give me even a shred of good news about your drug task force? The good news is I can be brief about it. We have nothing. Sorry, I had to talk my twins into getting their hair done. There are some promises involving lollipops I do not intend to keep. The task force has made some busts, but we still haven't found any high-level dealers or major drug stashes. But we will soon. Is that a promise? Or just another lollipop that no one's ever gonna lick? Wanch is waiting for this task force to fail. I need tangible results. Sarge and I are going undercover at Electric Library. It's a silent disco. Everyone wears headphones. It's actually very respectful to the neighbors, except for the lewd acts and vomiting. There's usually some ecstasy at these things, so hopefully we'll find some giggle pain. Great. I hope there's a lot of drug activity there. Of course, ideally, there will be nobody taking drugs there or anywhere else in the district, but if drugs must be found, let it be there. Please, God, let it be there. Drunk? 